Alright, so why do you want to upload this video today? Did you play really well? Nope, not at all. I'm a terrible Ninetales player. Hmm, okay, I see. So, the audio was very entertaining. You had a good time playing. No, actually, the audio was very echoey, and it wasn't entertaining at all. Hmm, hmm. Okay, then why are you gonna upload this video? What, what's wrong with you? Well, you should stick till the end. This game actually has an insane ending. Trust me, sir. Just upload it, and it'll be fine. You're fired. Upload the video anyways. Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be playing Ninetales. Uh, we're going to be playing Ninetales a little interestingly, probably unoptimally, but we're going Buddy Barrier and then the two glasses, Choice and Specs. That's what we're going on our Ninetales boy in the top lane. Me, my experience with Ninetales, just to get this out here, not much. I played a little bit at the beginning of the game when they were kind of busted, and that's about all. I was looking through my win rates and I was like, hmm, my Ninetales kind of insane. I don't really lose as this character, but then again, I don't really play this character, so let's go on in. Uh, we're, this is going to be an interesting experience, because I think Ninetales is a lot of fun. I don't think it's top tier character, but it feels like a lot more people have been playing it recently. Uh, it's definitely annoying to fight, you know? You guys know, you just get frozen and frozen, then it's just no good. Uh-oh, and I'm alone temporarily, because our LD is... AFK, and then my other two were fighting over the jungle temporarily. Ooh, speaking is still, still so hard. Alright, Ninja Boy, let's go. Still both got to level 3. Uh, it was an interesting match because we had three people call jungle, but it looks like we got it all sorted out. Uh, besides the LD, I think. He's just chilling, vibing. Oh, and we are going eject button for our uh, movement, just to the fact that it is kind of good just to get out. We don't have a lot of movement as this character. We want to stay away. And for those times that we do get pushed, you know, we're going to need to escape somehow. Okay, let's just push them away from our little Froakie. Froakie can't deal with this right now. Hmm, let's free A-bombs. Nice. All right, and again, we are going Avalanche and the other one, Blizzard, I think is what it's called. Just because we are going the range. This should do damage, but we don't quite block them off. Uh, oh, man, they got an Aggie jungle. Aggie jungle, man. Every now and then you see it. Uh, Iggy's still really good, I think. Not the best jungler in the game, but still, he's definitely viable. Definitely fun. Let me go. Is anyone still playing Iggy in the chat? Let me know. Let me know if anyone's still playing Iggy, because, oh, Alright, we got an LD Goss. They actually decided to take them with them. <laughs> Ronstead instantly said, I need a teammate, man. I'm surprised our jungler is jumping our lane instead of the bottom lane and giving him another man. Uh, kind of weird. Kind of a weird choice there. I'd definitely help the one person lane because they need help a lot more than we do. We have a very strong lane at our level four evolution. That's what makes Ninetales just so crazy, right? He evolves at level four and then he has a huge stat boost and he's just kind of nutty. Just a little nutty. Not as nutty as Greedent though, if you guys haven't seen that video. Greedent is absolutely nutty. Uh, jungle invades and all that stuff. But either way, this is the Ninetales video. What's up, Dizzy Joy? You see me? You probably see me. Let's just... Let's just hit him a little bit, just because we can. Just because we're mean like that. Ah, oh, poor, poor little Dissidue. Actually, he's probably going to die. <laughs> if we don't get him... Oh, we easily could have taken him out if he was on that ice wall. That's a shame. We're not... We eject put in there because we don't even want to risk dying to the Ralts. The Ralts is uh, a Ralts. And, you know, you don't want to feed a Ralts. If you don't feed a Ralts, they die. If you feed them, they kill you. Easy peasy. Ooh. I should really look at who, who they have on their team. Level 6 gets us our full build. That's kind of crazy. Um, because Gardevoir's ult, like, paired up with certain characters, is just like... Well, I guess I die now. Ugh, I can't get out of it. I can't. I just got slowed by slow smoke indefinitely. We overextended, like, three steps, and Aegis Sauce goes, no, 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 no. Dang, it's a shame. guess they're pushing Rodon. Uh, are they actually... Kinda wanna know. I don't wanna go up there for nothing and then die. So I might as well just come down here, secure this with our team even though they've already got it. I should've just went up. <laughs> now we know, now we know, right? Boop, we got it. Even though I think our blizzard got stuck on the wall. I didn't think that's how that works. We'll have to try it again. Yeah, they got Rotom. They got Rotom. Boop. See, Ninetales is so much fun. Maybe we'll try and attack a uh, crit build. You could go crit build on Ninetales. Uh, if you guys are interested in a video about that, let's go ahead and do that. If you don't know how it works, uh, Ninetales can't crit, usually, 
But if you build an item on him for crit, his basic attacks can start to crit. So you could go like uh, Aurora Veil, I think it's what it's called, which boosts your attacks, your basic attacks, and then go crit items. And I think that, I mean, it's not five. It's not bad. <laughs> it's not bad, I don't think. It's just not good. You're just kind of, you know, you could probably pop off with it if you do good. It's kind of like the Sigil. <laughs> You're just... Uh, that doesn't go through walls. I need to remember that. No, not to the walls. I don't like that stun. I don't like it at all. Curly, why? Why do you have a stun that lasts literally like three seconds? Like, Guardi's uh, stun is absurdly long, you know? It's like, I don't know. Very, very long. <sighs> I would say they need to shorten it, but Guardi's so, like, not that great anyways. It's really no point, right? Here we go, the Adinos. We're kind of waiting for these things to spawn. I also want to test if my Blizzard hits through walls. I, like I said, I'm not much of a Ninetales player, so I don't know every ins and outs of the guy, but let's go ahead and check. Avalanche goes through. Blizzard does too, I guess. Oh well. Let's see, set up an ambush. They're definitely pushing Rodom again, so I am going to stick up here this time, so I have a chance to steal it. I got my ult up. Blizzard and Avalanche are both pretty decent at stealing. Um, if I see their team gather down there, I'll go to help. But, you know, if not, there's no point. Yeah, okay. I think Decidueye is up here. They got three bottom. Oh, no point. <laughs> no point. We'll just sit up here and destroy the zone. We can't destroy the zone. Yeah, I mean Decidueye. As long as I keep him busy. Oh, okay, no. Blizzard does not go through walls. You've heard it here first. He gets stuck on that wall. Uh, it's just so weird. What is he doing? Why is he ulting me? Like, I'm not going to try to get it. I'm just preventing him from getting it so my team can get dread. That's kind of the play here. We have a very long-range basic attack, so maybe we should take advantage of that a little more. Stay a little further back. What is this? No, they got it. Oh, I didn't have any abilities up. Dang, he shredded that fast. Oh, well. We shouldn't get anything from it. Hopefully not. I'd rather fight this closer to my goal zone so it doesn't take me out like it's definitely doing. Oop. Oh, come on. They got Dreadnought too. That's a shame. Maybe I should have just went down there. I should have just let them have Rodom and then taken it out. Alright, we have to take out the Sidroy here. There we go. Um, but we're stuck at the Rodom. They are destroying that bottom zone so hard. I kind of forgot that LD is AFK. Or he's gone. He left the game. So it was really just a 3v4 plus a bot, <laughs> which is whatever, I guess. Uh, it's going to be a really hard match for us to win. Hopefully that Eldegoss did pick Cotton Guard. So if he did, that means all he has to do is just survive and stay around us. So I guess it's not the worst person to have left the game. I just don't get why he queued in and then just left. Maybe he, uh, you know how the game crashes sometimes. Maybe that happened. But you could, you could rejoin. Fun fact, you could rejoin if your game crashes. Even if you're, like, not a high level when you come back, you'll still be a help to the team if you could come back. Better than a bot. <laughs> really? <laughs> Our bot just ulted with no one around at the 2 minute mark or 250 mark. So he won't have it back for Zap. Hmm. Oh, that's cool. Why, why are they just sitting in the bush there? There's no reason for that. There's actually no reason. Why are they just chilling in that bush? Not grinding, not doing anything. Alright. Oh, our team's taking that fight. It's scary. If we could take someone out in the next, like, 15 seconds, that could be really big for us. Set up an ambush. I mean, I think it's just me in here. Faith, Lucario. Oh, he's down an ult. Oh, and we're down at life. We'll spawn just in time. Uh, shoot, we're all dead. An LD won't move unless the person who took them is alive, which they're not going to be alive for five seconds. Ah, uh, that is a shame. Oh, we're losing by so much. We need to, like, fully get Zapdos in order to win, like, all of us score, like, 100 points. They aren't flipping it, surprisingly. They are not flipping it. Uh, Lucario's ult's down. I think one more of their ults are down. But me and Greninja both have it up, so that could be really big for us. I agree trying to flip it, but at the same time, I think we should take a few of them out. We just don't do damage to it. We can just push them away if they get close. Alright, we got it. And we ulted. Ooh. 
I wanted to take out the Sidroi, but I think it would have been too scary to. Uh, yeah, let me score first so that uh, you could score after me. Like we both score here. I'm not sure if it would have been better to let LD there. Uh, okay, yeah, Talon just has to defend and we have to score as much as we can. Nice, nice. I don't know why they're trying to counter. Oh my gosh, that goal zone isn't even destroyed. Dang it, they're just sitting here. They're chilling on it. Come on, freeze him. Dang it, he got frozen as I died. So I, I should have waited two seconds or less for Blizzard to be back up. Lose my 16 points. That's my bad for not just waiting a second. We overdumped a lot in their goal zone. Like down here, but we haven't even destroyed this one. So it's a little rough. Yeah, there's just this talent flame on it. Unless you have score shield, there's nothing you can do. Well, you can unite move it. Oh, I see what he's doing. He has buddy barrier, score shield. But it's just not enough. Oh, shoot, he did. That's pretty crazy. All right. Uh, if we just defend, there's a chance. Especially if Greninja scores there. Uh, I don't think he has time, but he's definitely going to try. It's a respectable. Respectable team. I gotta agree. Even the man down. We tried our best. Alright, let's see how this one pulled around. Let us see. Look at them fighting up there. I'm surprised Talon got that score. They Two of them were hammering him, too. We only scored like 90 off sap. Oh, no. We scored like 190 off sap. And then another 100. Then... Oh, no way! We won that! That's insane! Wow! Good job, Talon and Greninja. Good job to my entire team that was playing the game. That's so crazy. How did that scoreboard look? Wow. Okay. We got it. We got it, guys. That was a crazy turnaround. A 4v5 against a pretty solid team. We are able to flip zap. And then Talon scored the final 100 points. It pushed us through. That's crazy. That's absolutely insane. Alright guys, if you guys enjoyed this Nine Tails video, be sure to like, subscribe, comment down below. Let me know what you guys think of Nine Tails. Good, bad, meh. You know, run Cram tier. I think a little better than Cram. Either way, let me know. Uh, like, the, also subscribe for like that game. That was crazy. Alright, love y'all. Bubble out, guys. Alright, so why do you want to upload this video today? Did you play really well? Nope, not at all. I'm a terrible Nine Tails player. I see. So the audio is very entertaining. You had a good time playing. No, actually, the audio was very echoey and it wasn't entertaining at all. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, then why are you gonna upload this video? What, what's wrong with you? Well, you should stick till the end. This game actually has an insane ending. Trust me, sir. Just upload it and it'll be fine. You're fired. Upload the video anyways.